Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover adding three digit numbers using base 10 blocks. These problems are going to be without regrouping. Now using base 10 blocks is going to help us visualize what's going on within these problems and give us a better overall understanding of addition. So let's jump into number one where we have 241 plus 157. Both of those numbers are represented by base 10 blocks to the right of the problem. Now when we add, we're going to start with the ones place. So we have one one plus seven ones. One one is represented right here from the number 241. And then seven ones from the number 157 is represented right here. So one plus seven is going to give us a total of eight ones. Now we work our way to the left. So we have the tens place next. We have four groups of 10 plus five groups of 10 or 40 plus 50. So four groups of 10 is represented right here because in the number 241, we have a four in the tens place. That represents four groups of 10 and has a value of 40. Now in 157, we have a five in the tens place. That means we have five groups of 10 and that's represented right there. That five has a value of 50. So four groups of 10 plus five groups of 10 gives us nine groups of 10. And that nine has a value of 90. Lastly, we have to add the hundreds place. So in 241, we have a two in the hundreds place. That means two groups of 100, and that has a value of 200. Now in 157, we have a one in the hundreds place. That means we have one group of 100. That one has a value of 100 because it's in the hundreds place and represents one group of 100. So two groups of 100 plus one group of 100 equals three groups of 100. That gives us a three in the hundreds place. That three has a value of 300. So our final answer is 398. To recap, we did one one plus seven ones. That gives us a total of eight ones. Then we did four tens plus five tens. That gives us a total of nine tens. And then two hundreds plus one hundred gives us a total of three groups of 100. And that has a value of 300. So final answer, 398. Let's move on to number two, where we have 632 plus 321. And we start with the ones place. So two ones from 632 plus one one from 321. That gives us a total of three ones. Let's move to the tens place. So we have three tens or 30 plus two tens or 20. Three tens plus two tens gives us a total of five tens or 50. And then lastly, we have the hundreds. So for 632, we have a six in the hundreds place. That represents six groups of 100 and can be seen right here, six groups of 100. That has a value of 600. Now for 321, we have a three in the hundreds place. That represents three groups of 100 and has a value of 300. So six groups of 100 plus three groups of 100 gives us nine groups of 100 or a nine in the hundreds place. And that nine has a value of 900. So to recap, two ones plus one one equals three ones. Now we move to the tens place. So three tens or 30 plus two tens or 20 gives us five tens, which has a value of 50. And then lastly, the hundreds. Six groups of 100 plus three groups of 100, or 600 plus 300 gives us a nine in the hundreds place, which has a value of 900. So a final answer of 953. So there you have it. There's how you add three digit numbers using base 10 blocks. I hope that helped. 
Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.